Well, I've been testing this, excuse my voice, I've got a bit of a cold. Um, I've been testing this for the past week, it's working fine, um, it's balancing. Uh, obviously I've got to tidy all these wires up and then I've got to put it all back together somehow. That's for the buzzer, that's the Bluetooth, so everything's all ready. So now I've got to tip it on its back and then I've got to put it all back together and I'm not going to be able to show it you. Um, it charges, everything works fine, it balances fine. It's losing round about uh, 2 millivolts per week if I leave it standing on bank number 6 which is, you know, it's acceptable. So I've got to put it all back together now and then do it all properly this time. Here's my battery. Here's me being pissed off. Actually, I can't show it. I've put it all back together. It looks like I've either trapped a wire or there's a wire loose or there's something come loose somewhere. F because I always show my mistakes, slight cock ups, total f ups, I suppose. Oh dear, <laughs> that was lucky, <laughs> oh dear, 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 looks like that was what the problem was. It's finally done and properly this time, the fan ain't on at the minute because it's not balancing, well it is balancing but not, oh, f the fan isn't turning at the minute because I want to check the um, temperature. So if I plug that in, and then I watch the temperature drop, which it does. It works perfectly actually. You can see now that all the cells, I think it's two millivolts, bank number six is always the same. It loses, I don't know, two or three millivolts a week that's all that's fine so I'm just going to balance these perfectly charge them all to 3.7 volts just to put them into a storage state and then everything's good the battery connector for the fan is there I've done this now that's the right uh, the right mount for the phone so the phone goes on top there and then I can see all the voltages absolutely everything Perfect. It's ready for the spring, and I'm going to get some miles on this this year. I want to run it into the. I want to run this battery into the ground because obviously on the the winter or the the autumn winter is going to be the uh, builder version four. I think I'm going to be using this detachable sort of idea as well, but put more batteries on here, which I don't even know if I can show you without breaking this apart. As you can see, I've got all this space here. Um, the actual the holder at the bottom of the frame actually uh, comes up to here. So I've got literally all that. And there's a lot of padding in here as well, which I can get rid of. So I can make this a lot bigger, which will give me the 108 or 113 volts, I don't know what to go for yet, whether it's going to be 32S or what it's going to be. Might be 130 volts if I can get away with it, I don't know. So, this is obviously version 3, version 4 is going to be bigger and better and faster. Thank mm -hmm. you.